I understand the Iranians are walking uh, around very satisfied in Geneva, as well they should be, because they got everything and paid nothing, everything they wanted. They wanted relief of sanctions after years of a uh, grueling sanctions regime. They got that. They're paying nothing because they're not reducing in any way their nuclear uh, enrichment capability. So Iran got the deal of the century, and the international community got a bad deal. This is a very bad deal. Uh, and Italy, Israel utterly rejects it, and what I'm saying is shared by many, many in the regions, whether or not they express it publicly. Israel is not obliged by this agreement, and Israel will do everything it needs to do to defend itself and to defend the security of its people. That is true also of our negotiations with the Palestinians. I will never compromise on Israel's security and our vital interests, not in the face of any international pressure. I think the pressure has to be put where it belongs, that is, on the Palestinians who refuse to budge. But I think in any case, no amount of pressure will make me or the government of Israel compromise on the basic security and national interest of the state of Israel. And the people of Israel know this, and they support it as they should.